32 contestants, one regional champion. Who will win the Dallas Morning News Regional Spelling Bee? Here's Todd Whitford, co-host of Channel 8's Good Morning Texas and MC of this year's competition. Thank you and welcome to the 39th Annual Dallas Morning News Regional Spelling Bee. These spellers took first place honors at county spelling bees throughout North Texas and will compete this morning for the Dallas Regional Championship for valuable prizes. And today's champion will earn the right to represent the Dallas region at the National Spelling Bee in Washington, D.C. Now here are the contestants, each one certainly already a champion. They represent the best among close to 100,000 students from 700 schools who participated in spelling bees at the classroom level. Now, in order to compete in today's bee, they had to study 3,000 words and win spell downs at the classroom, district, and county levels. The winners of today's competition will be awarded these great prizes. The champion and their guest will win an all-expense-paid trip to Washington, D.C. as guests of the Dallas Morning News that will include sightseeing and the chance to become the National Spelling Bee Champion. The champion will also receive Merriam-Webster's third new international dictionary, a five-pound Hershey chocolate bar, a Sony CD Walkman from Ed Kellum and Son, and a $200 fashion wardrobe from Foley's. Today's runner-up will win Compton's Interactive Encyclopedia, Merriam-Webster's Collegiate Dictionary, a gift certificate for Blockbuster Video, a $150 fashion wardrobe from Foley's, and tickets to the Dallas Children's Theater. The third place winner will receive a Bookman Advanced Thesaurus, a $100 fashion wardrobe from Foley's, a gift certificate for Blockbuster Video, and a Scripps Howard gift certificate. The top three winners will also receive a family membership for four to the Dallas Museum of Natural History and four passes to a Texas Rangers baseball game. All of today's contestants will receive Hershey's Kisses, a case of Dr. Pepper, General Cinema movie passes, and a $5 gift certificate from Half Price Books, Records, and Magazines. Those are the prizes, Todd. Now, let's see who wins them. All right. This is live TV. I wish you could feel the excitement here in the studio. Before we begin, I want to remind all of you at home that your program for today is in this morning's edition of the Dallas Morning News on page 25A. Now let's meet our distinguished officials today. The pronouncer is Joe Goyne, senior lecturer in the English department at Southern Methodist University. Our judges are Turner Cobbler, Emerita Professor of English at Texas Women's University, and Thomas Art, Professor of English at Southern Methodist University. Standard American spelling bee rules prevail. One miss, and the contestant is out. And now, here's Joe Goyne and the contestants in the Dallas Morning News Regional Spelling Bee. Good morning, spellers. Let's begin. Gigantic. Gigantic. G I G A N T I C. That's right. Good. Dismal. Repeat the word? Yes. Dismal. Dismal. D I S M A L. Dismal? Yes. Hulking. Hulking. H-U-L-K-I-N-G. Hulking. Correct. Bantam. Definition, please. Certainly. Small and easily handled. Origin. A Javanese name. Thank you. Bantam. B-A-N-T-U-M. Bantam. Sorry. It's B-A-N-T-A-M, Bantam. Dingo. Dingo. May I have a definition? A wild dog of Australia. Dingo. D-I-N-G-O, Dingo. Right. Blather. Definition, please. Voluble, foolish, or nonsensical talk. Blather. B L A T H E R. Blather. Right. Hearsay. Hearsay. H E A R S A Y. Hearsay. 
Invisible. Invisible. I N V I S I B L E. Invisible. Uh -huh. Acre. Definition, please. Any of various units of land area. Acre. A C R E. Acre. Right. Dimension. Dimension. D I M E N S I O N. Dimension. Humane. Humane. May I have the definition, please? Mm -hmm. Marked by compassion, sympathy, or consideration for other human beings or animals. Humane. H U M A N E. Humane. Right. Dinosauric. Dinosauric. D I N O S A U R I C. Good. Doddler. Doddler. D A W D L E R. Doddler. Peninsula. Peninsula. P E N N I N S I L A. Oh, I'm sorry, it's P E N I N S U L A. Mastodon. Mastodon. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Someone or something of gigantic size or unusually large size. Giant. Mastodon. M A S. T-O-D-O-N, Mastodon. Right. Disagreeable. Disagreeable. D-I-S-A-G-R-E-E-A-B-L-E. That's right. Durable. Durable. D U R A B L E, durable. Yes. Mammoth. Mammoth. M A M M O T H, mammoth. Right. <coughs> Quest. Quest. Can I have the definition, please? Uh -huh. An act or instance of searching, an expedition, pursuit, venture. Quest, Q U E S T, quest. Liberalism. Liberalism. May I have a definition, please? Uh -huh. A political philosophy based on the belief in freedom for the individual and on the belief of governmental guarantees of human rights and civil liberties. Liberalism. L I B E R A L I S M, liberalism. Resolute. Resolute. R E S O L U T E. Resolute. Thermometer. Thermometer. T H E R M O M E T E R. Thermometer. Uh -huh. Magnitude. Magnitude. M A G N I T U D E. Magnitude. Right. Disappearance. Disappearance. D I S A P P E A R A N C E. Disappearance. Right. Skimpiness. Definition, please. Uh -huh. The quality or state of being deficient in supply or execution. Skimpiness, 
S K I M P I N E S S. Right. <coughs> Poised. Poised. May I have a definition, please? Mm -hmm. Marked by an easy composure of manner or bearing. Poised. P O I S E D. Poised. Right. Furiously. Furiously. <coughs> F U R I O U S L Y. Furiously. Badgers. Badgers. B A D G E R S. Badgers. Right. Solarium. Could you please repeat the word? Mm -hmm. Solarium. Could I please have a definition? Mm -hmm. A glass enclosed porch or living room. Solarium. Could you please use it in a sentence? Mm -hmm. Lacey moved her sunlight starved fern from her bedroom to the solarium. Solarium. C E L L A R I U M. Solarium. Sorry. S O L A R I U M. Cavalcade. Could you repeat the word? Cavalcade. C A L V I L C A D E. No, I'm sorry. C A V A L C A D E. Horizontal. Horizontal. H O R. I Z O N T A L, horizontal. Yes. <laughs> Potentate. Potentate. P O T E N T A T E. Praline. Will you repeat the word? Praline. Praline. P R A L I N E. Praline. Mm -hmm. Praline. Mm -hmm. Make sure you all speak right into the microphone and speak up. Puritanical. Puritanical. P U R I T A N I C A L. Puritanical. Bewitched. Bewitched. May I have the definition? Mm -hmm. Cast a spell over. Bewitched. B E W I T C H E D. Bewitched. Excavator. Could you use it in a sentence, please? Certainly. The excavator gasped when the side of the pit gave way to reveal a dark chamber. Excavator. E X C A V A T O R. Affliction. Affliction. Could you give me the definition, please? A state of pain, distress, or grief. Affliction. A F F L I C T I O N. Affliction. Unfavorable. Unfavorable. U N F A V O R A B L E. Unfavorable. Good. Intricate. Could I have a definition, please? Mm -hmm. Having many complexly interrelating parts or elements. Complicated. Could you use it in a sentence? Mm -hmm. Jason described the intricate mechanism of the clock as awesome. Intricate. I N T R I C A T E. Intricate. Good. Tobacco. Tobacco. T O B A C C O. Tobacco. Right. C 
sibilant. May I have a definition, please? Mm -hmm. Having, containing, or producing the sound of, or a sound resembling that of the S or SH in sash. Symbolant. S Y M B O L A N T. Symbolant. I'm sorry, it's sibilant. S I B I L A N T. Aerobatics. Aerobatics. <clears throat> A E R O B A T I C S, aerobatics. Right. Bulbous. Bulbous. B U L B O U S, bulbous. Right. Perceived. Perceived. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Became aware of through the senses. Perceived. P E R C E I V E D. Perceived. Right. Perilous. Perilous. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Full of, attended with, or involving danger. Perilous. P E R I L. O U S. Good. Luminary. Luminary. L U M I N A R Y. Good. Chimpanzee. Chimpanzee. C H I M P A N Z E E. Chimpanzee. Good. Giraffe. Giraffe. G I R A F F E. Giraffe. Marmoset. Can you repeat the word, please? Marmoset. Marmoset. May I have a definition? Mm -hmm. Any of numerous small, soft furred South and Central American monkeys with claws instead of nails on all the digits except the great toe. Marmoset. M A R M A S E T. Marmoset. Sorry. M A R M O S E T. Avionics. Avionics. A V I O N I C S. Marsupial. Marsupial. Mm -hmm. M A R S U P L E. M A R S U P I A L. Asunder. Asunder. A S S U N D E R. Asunder. I'm sorry. A S U N D E R. Sermonize. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Address at length in a didactic and solemn manner. Could you repeat the word, please? Sermonize. Sermonize. S-U-R-M-I. Could you repeat the word, please? Sermonize. S-U-R-M-I-N-I-Z-E. -E. Sermonize. Uh. S E R M O N I Z E. Adjacent. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Living nearby or sitting or standing relatively near or close together. Could you use it in a sentence? Mm -hmm. Citizens of Centerville and its adjacent communities banded together to form a volunteer fire department. Adjacent. A D J A. C E N T. <laughs> A 
Abacus. Abacus. May I have a definition, please? Mm -hmm. A calculating instrument for performing arithmetical processes by sliding counters by hand on rods or in grooves. May I have this in its place? Mm -hmm. The grocer used an abacus instead of a modern cash register. Would you please repeat the word? Abacus. Abacus. A-B-A-C-U-S. That's right. Exude. Exude. E-X-U-D-E. -E. Exude. That's right. Stratified. Stratified. S-T-R-A-T-I-F-I-E-D. Stratified. Right. Laud. Can you repeat the word? Laud. Can you uh, give me a definition? Certainly. To sing the praises of. Can you give me the background? Latin, the, from the Latin. And um, in a sentence. Mm -hmm. The proud parents would laud their child's slightest accomplishment. Laud. L A. U E D. Laud? No, I'm sorry. L A U D. <laughs> Azimuth. Azimuth. A Z I M U T H. That's right. Julianne. Can you give me a definition? Mm -hmm. Cut in long, thin strips used especially of vegetables and fruits. Will you repeat the word? Mm -hmm. Julianne. J U L I E N N E. Yes. Julianne. <laughs> Meagerness. Meagerness. May I have a definition, please? Uh -huh. The quality or state of being small, thin, or inadequate. Meagerness. M-E-A-G-E-R-N-E-S-S. -E -E -S. Meagerness. Right. Ghastly. Ghastly. May I have a definition? Uh -huh. Giving rise to terror, frightening. Ghastly. G H A S T L Y Gasly. Good. <coughs> Suffice. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Be enough. Meet or satisfy a need. Sentence, please. One teaspoonful of salt will suffice for the stew. Origin of the word, please. From the Latin. Can you repeat it again? Mm -hmm. Suffice. 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 S-U-F. I C E. Suffice. No, I'm sorry. S U F F I C E. <clears throat> Calabash. Calabash. Could you give, use, um, give me the definition? Mm -hmm. A common bottle gourd. <clears throat> Could you use it in a sentence, mm -hmm. please? A calabash, <clears throat> pardon me. A calabash with a hole cut in it makes a dandy birdhouse. Okay. Could you say it again? <laughs> calabash. Calabash. C A L A B A S H Calabash Bablative Bablative Can I have a definition please? Mm -hmm. Given to excessive talking, garrulous. Can, can we use it in a sentence? Yes. The bablative waitress called everyone at our table sweetheart. 
Will you say, repeat the word? Yes, bablative. Bablative. B A B B L A T I V E. Bablative. That's right. Aporia. Could I have a definition, please? Mm -hmm. A passage in speech or writing incorporating or presenting a difficulty or a doubt. Could you use it in a sentence? The Bible verse, then the steward said within himself, what shall I do, is an aporia. Could you pronounce it again? Aporia. Aporia. A-P-H-O-R-I-A. -A. Aporia. A-P-O-R-I-A. Octahedron. Octahedron. O C T A H E D R O N. Octahedron. Okay. Fantasize. Fantasize. F A N T A. S I Z E. Fantasize. <laughs> right. <laughs> Epus. Epus. May I have a definition? Mm -hmm. A body of poetry expressing the tradition of a people. Can you use it in a sentence? The ancient epos survived in later literature. Can you please repeat the word? Epos. Epos. E P O S. Epos. Taciturnity. Taciturnity. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. The quality or state of being disinclined or reluctant to talk or converse. Taciturnity. T A C I T U R N I T Y. Good. <coughs> Pungent. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Causing a sharp sensation, pricking, irritating, or acrid. Pungent. P U N G E N T. Pungent. Sulfatara. You have a definition? Mm -hmm. A volcanic area or vent that yields sulfur gases and hot vapors and represents a late stage of volcanic activity. Repeat the word Sulfatara. Sulfatara, S-U-L-P-H-I-T-A-R-A. -A. Sorry, S-O-L-F-A-T-A-R-A. -A. Diffraction. Diffraction, D-E-F-R-A-C-T-I-O-N, diffraction. D I F F R A C T I O N. Stupendous. Stupendous. Can I have the definition, please? Of amazing size or greatness. Stupendous. S T U P E N D O U S. Stupendous. Right. Indisputable. Indisputable. I-N-D-I-S-P-U-T-A-B-L-E. Right. Olfactometry. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. The testing and measurement of the sensitivity of the sense of smell. Could you repeat the word? Olfactometry. <clears throat> Could you repeat it again? Olfactometry. Olfactometry. O L F A C T O M E T R Y. Good. Distal. Distal. May I have a definition, please? Uh -huh. Located away from the center of the body. May I have a sentence, please? The professor asked the students to identify the distal and proximal ends of several bones. Please repeat the word. Distal. Distal. 
D I S T A L. Rumor monger. Rumor monger. R U M O R M O N G E R. Rumor monger. Good. Innovation. <coughs> Innovation. I N N O V A T I O N. Innovation. Otitis. Otitis. O T I T U S. I'm sorry. O T I T I S. <coughs> Oxymoron. Oxymoron. Mm -hmm. Can you give me a definition? <coughs> Certainly. A combination for epigrammatic effect of contradictory or incongruous words. Will you repeat the word? Could you speak up just a little bit? Could you repeat the word? Yes, oxymoron. Oxymoron. O X I M O R O N. Oxymoron. Sorry. O X Y M O R O N. Jejun. Jejun. J A J U N E. Jejun. I'm sorry. J E J U N E. Meringue. <clears throat> Meringue. We have a definition. A mixture of beaten egg whites and powdered sugar, baked at a low temperature and used as a topping on pies or puddings. Meringue. M E R I N G U E. Meringue. Good. <laughs> Philologist. Philologist. Could you give me the definition? Mm -hmm. A scholar concerned with human speech as the vehicle of literature and as a field of study that, that sheds light on cultural history. Could you use it in a sentence? Mm -hmm. Hannah wants to become a philologist and study ancient Russian dialects. Philologist. P-H-I-L-O-L-O-G-I-S-T. Mm -hmm. Philologist. <laughs> Monomaniacal. Um, can I have a definition, please? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Relating to, characterized by, or affected with such concentration on a single object or idea as to suggest mental derangement. Um, can I have a sentence, please? Mm -hmm. Stewart's obsession with racing cars seems almost monomaniacal to his friends. Could you repeat the word? Monomaniacal. Monomaniacal. M O N O. M E N I A C L E. Sorry, M O N O M A N I A C A L. Grampus. Grampus. Can I have a definition, please? Mm -hmm. A cetacean of temperate and tropical seas, having a blunt snout and teeth in the lower jaw only. Could you repeat the word? Grampus. Grampus, G-R-A-M-P-U-S, Grampus. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> vertiginate. Vertiginate. Could you use it in a sentence? Mm -hmm. Young children love to vertiginate until they fall down. Vertiginate. V. E R T I G N A T E. Sorry, V E R T I G I N A T E. Edelweiss. Edelweiss. Can you have a definition? Mm -hmm. A small perennial herb growing high in the Alps. Can you use it in a sentence? Mm -hmm. Iva recognized the Edelweiss by its distinctive white petals. Edelweiss. E D E L. E 
Edelweiss, E D E L W I E S S, Edelweiss. I'm sorry, E D E L W E I S S. Wapiti. Wapiti. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. A North American deer, similar to the European red deer, but considerably larger. Wapiti. W A P I T I. Wapiti. That's right. Mastoiditis. Uh, pronounce again, please. Mastoiditis. Uh, definition? Mm -hmm. Inflammation of the process of the temporal bone behind the ear. Mastoiditis. M A S T O I D I T I S. Mastoiditis. Good. Marzipan. Marzipan. And the definition, please? Mm -hmm. A confection made of crushed almonds or almond paste, sugar and egg whites that is often shaped into various forms as fruit or animals. Okay, marzipan, M-A-R-Z-I-P-A-N, marzipan. Good. Impresario. Impresario, I-M-P-R-E-S, a R I O. That's right. Page 27. Sorry. Heart of Beast. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. A large African antelope with short ringed divergent horns. Could you use it in a sense? Mm -hmm. The Heart of Beast grazes mainly in the open plains and scrublands of sub Saharan Africa. Could you repeat the word? Heart of beast. Heart of beast. H E A R T E B E A S T. Sorry. H A R T E B E E S T. Impromptu. Impromptu. We have a definition to mm -hmm. please. Without previous study, preparation, or consideration, on the spur of the moment. Would you please repeat the word? Impromptu. May I have an indefinition? May I have, may I have it in the sentence? Yes. Leah is able to speak impromptu and at length on countless subjects. Would you repeat it one more time? Impromptu. Impromptu. I-M-P-R-O-M-P-T-U-D-E. Sorry. I M P R O M P T U. Fulgurant. Fulgurant. May I have a definition? Flashing like lightning, dazzling. Fulgurant. F U L G E R A N T. F U L G U R A N T. Okay, now spellers, at this point, we'll no longer distinguish between rounds, and we'll continue the competition uninterrupted. Haiku. Haiku. Uh -huh. Haiku. H-A-I-K-U, haiku. Right. Chandel. Chandel. May I have the definition? An abrupt climbing turn of an airplane. Chandel. C H A N D E L L E. Chandel. Right. Cyrenian. Cyrenian. Could you um, give me the definition? Mm -hmm. Any of an order of aquatic herbivorous mammals, including the manatee and stellar sea cow. Could you use that sentence, please? The future of the Cyrenian in Florida is in doubt because the, of the increasing boat traffic. Cyrenian. C-I-R-E-N-I-A-N. Cyrenian. 
I'm sorry, S-I-R-E-N-I-A-N. Rhesus. Rhesus. Can I have the definition, please? Mm -hmm. A pale brown Asian monkey, often used in medical research. Could you use it in a sentence? The rhesus was the first monkey to be rocketed into the stratosphere. Rhesus. R-H-E-S-U-S. -E rhesus. Albedometer. Albedometer. Mm -hmm. Definition, please. A device for measuring the reflection of light, as by snow. Albedometer. A L B E D O M E T E R. Albedometer. Cribral. Mm -hmm. uh, say it again, please. Cribral. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Of or relating to a sieve. Perforated. Cribral. C R I B R A L. Cribral. Right. Hypotactic. Hypotactic. Can I have the definition? Mm -hmm. Of, relating to, or exhibiting syntactic subordination as by conjunction. Can you use it in sentence? Mm -hmm. You and love the complicated hypotactic prose of academic German. Hypotactic. H Y P O T A C T I C. Hypotactic. Good. Pertinacious. May mm, I have a definition? Mm -hmm. Stubbornly unshakable. Pertinacious. P E R. T I N A C E O U S? No, I'm sorry. P E R T I N A C I O U S. Sukiyaki. Sukiyaki. S U K I Y A K I. Sukiyaki. That's right. Ornithopter. Or an adopter. May I please have the definition? Mm -hmm. A heavier than air airplane deriving its chief support and propulsion from flapping wings. Or an adopter. O R N I T H O P T E R. Or an adopter. Mm -hmm. Anecdote. Anecdote. A N E C D O T E. Anecdote. Right. Slantendicular. Slantendicular. Definition, please. Somewhat oblique. Slantendicular. S L A N T I N D I C U L A R. Slantendicular. Right. Hosanna. Hosanna. Definition, please. An expression of enthusiastic praise, acclamation. Hosanna. J O S A N N A Hosanna. Sorry, H O S A N N A. Mansard. Mansard, kind of definition. A roof having two slopes on all sides, with the lower slope steeper than the upper one. Mansard. Mm -hmm. M A N S A R D, Mansard. Good. Reliquary. Reliquary. R E L I Q U A R Y. Reliquary. Good. <laughs> Accrescent. Accrescent. May I please have a definition? Mm -hmm. Growing continuously, specifically, growing larger after flowering. A crescent, a crescent. A C C R E S C E N T, a crescent. Right. Pyrethrum. Pyrethrum. Can I have the definition, please? Mm -hmm. Any of various chrysanthemums with finely divided and often aromatic leaves. Pyrethrum, P-I-R-I-P-H-R-E-M-U-M. 
I'm sorry, P-Y-R-E-T-H-R-U-M. Everybody remember to speak up loudly. Cochleariform. Cochleariform. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. Shaped like a spoon. Cochleariform. C-O-C-H-L-E-A-R-I-F-O-R-M. Cochleariform. Good. Minuscular. Minuscular. And the definition? Mm -hmm. Very small in size or important. Minuscular. M I N U S C U L A R minuscular. Mm -hmm. Cycnocarpus. Cycnocarpus. S Y C H N O C A R P O U S. Cycnocarpus. Okay. Arbustle. Arbustle. May I please have a definition? A dwarf tree or tree-like shrub. Arbustle. A-R-B-U-S-C-L-E. Arbustle. Good. Panegyric. Panegyric. Definition, please. Mm -hmm. An oration or writing expressing praise. Panegyric. P-A-N. A G Y R I C. I'm sorry. P A N E G Y R I C. Epithet. Epithet. Can I have the definition? Mm -hmm. A disparaging or abusive word or phrase. Epithet. E P I T H E T, epithet. Uh -huh. Gongorism. Gongorism. G O N G O R I S M. Gongorism. Good. Alliteration. Alliteration. May please have a definition? Uh -huh. The repetition, usually initially, of a sound that is usually a consonant in two or more neighboring words or syllables, as in daring deed. Alliteration. A L L I T E R A T I O N. Alliteration. Mm -hmm. Kielbasa. Kielbasa. I have a sentence. Adria ordered a half pound of potato salad and a kielbasa from the deli. Kielbasa. K-I-E-L-B-A-S-A. -E kielbasa. All right. Sententious. What? Sententious. Uh, could you give me a definition? Mm -hmm. Terse, aphoristic, or moralistic in expression. Pithy. Can you repeat the word? Sententious. Sententious. S-E-N-T-E-N-T-I-O-U-S. -E -E That's right. Sensorious. Sensorious. May I please have a definition? Marked by or given to an inclination to discover and severely condemn, especially social, moral, or artistic errors. Could you please put the word in the sentence? Mm -hmm. Helen was in one of her censorious moods at the reception this evening. Could you repeat the word? Censorious. Censorious. C-E-N-S-O-R-I-O-U-S. Censorious. That's right. Psalmody. Psalmody. Have a definition? Mm -hmm. The act, practice, or art of singing sacred songs in worship. Psalmody. P S A L M O D Y. Good. Ardwolf. Ardwolf. A A R D W O L F. Ardwolf. Good. Catastasis. 
metastasis. Could you please give me a definition? Mm -hmm. The dramatic complication immediately preceding the climax of a play. Catastasis. C-A-T-A-S-T-A-S-I-S. -S Catastasis. Good. Colobus. Colobus. In the definition. Mm -hmm. Any of a genus of slender, long-tailed African monkeys. Colobus. C-O-L-O-B-U-S. Colobus. Right. Desmond. Desmond. D-E-S-M-A-N. Desmond. Right. Ratatouille. Ratatouille. R-A-T-A-T-O-U-I-L-L-E. Ratatouille. Uh -huh. Derailer. Derailer. My definition. Uh -huh. A mechanism for shifting gears on a bicycle that operates by moving the chain from one set of exposed gears to another. Derailer. D E R A I L L E U R. Derailer. Quokka. Quokka. Q-U-O-K-K-A. Quokka. That's good. Eratology. Eratology. Could you please give me the definition? Mm -hmm. A narrative of the miraculous deeds of a god or hero. Eratology. A-R-E-T-A-L-O-G-Y. Eratology. Right. Radicchio. Radicchio. Have the definition? A chicory of a red variety with variegated leaves that is used as a salad green. Radicchio. R-A-D-I-C-C-H-I-O. Radicchio. Good. Cordillera. Cordillera. Oh, can I have a definition? Uh -huh. A group of mountain ranges forming a mountain system of great linear extent. Cordillera. C-O-R-D-I-L-L-E-R-A. Cordillera. That's right. Anadiplosis. Anadiplopis. Could you please give me the definition? Repetition of a prominent word, usually the last in a phrase, clause, sentence, or verse, at the beginning of the next phrase, clause, sentence, or verse. An anaplopus. A N A T I P L O P I S. An anaplopus. Sorry, A N A D I P L O S I S. Okay, now, as you know, when only two spellers remain in the competition, the rules for elimination change. In order to win the B, a speller must correct the other speller's mistake, then spell the next word correctly. Okay? Good. Gaino. Gaino. Can I have the definition? Mm -hmm. Any of various long-tailed, chiefly arboreal African monkeys. Gaino. And the origin? French. Gaino. G U E N O N. Gaino. Good. Lampyrid. Lampyrid. L A M P Y R I D. Lampyrid. And Guantibo. And Guantibo. No definition? A small lemur of Western Africa having a rather long snout and a rudimentary tail. And the origin? I'll have to look that one up. <coughs> Lucy. 
Well, I'm sorry, it's, it's E-F-I-K, which I'm not sure what that means. Okay. Anguantibo? Anguantibo, yes. A-N-G-W-A-N-T-I-B-O, Anguantibo. Yes. I'm glad you didn't need it. <laughs> Rabdomancer. Rabdomancer. R-H-A-B-D-O-M-A-N-C-E-R, Rabdomancer. Right. <coughs> Obloquy. Obloquy, mm -hmm. the definition? A strongly and often, and often intemperately condemnatory utterance. Obloquy. Mm -hmm. O-B-L-O-Q-U-Y, obloquy. Right. Botryoidal. Botryoidal. B-O-T-R-Y-O-I-D-A-L. Botryoidal. Gymnure. Mm -hmm. Gymnure. Mm -hmm. A definition? A small whitish insectivorous mammal of southeastern Asia having a long snout and a long naked tail. Can you repeat the word? Gymnure. Gymnure. G Y M N U R E, Jimmyer. Right. Crescited. Crescited. C R I C E T I D, crescited. Right. Proscenium. Proscenium. Have a definition? The part of a modern stage in front of the curtain. And the origin? From the Greek. Proscenium. P R O S C E N I U M. Proscenium. Right. Pityriasis. Pityriasis. P I T Y. R I A S I S, pityriasis. Good. You pagan. You pagan. U P E Y G A N, you pagan. Right. Visceroptosis. Visceroptosis. V I S C E R O P T O S I S, visceroptosis. Pick a lily. Pick a lily. P I C C A L I L L I. Pick a lily. Right. Tarsier. Tarsier. T A R S I E R. Tarsier. Right. Ovibus. Ovibus. Have the definition? A heavy set, shaggy coated wild ox now confined to Greenland and the barren northern lands of North America, also called a musk ox. And the origin? From the Latin. O V I B O S. Ovibus. Right. Barak. Barak. Can I have a definition? Mm -hmm. A monkey of southeastern Asia having a short, slender tail, which is held in the shape of the letter S when the animal is excited. Barak. B E R O K. Barak. Mm -hmm. Bradycism. Bradycism. B R A D Y. S E I S M, Bradycism. Mm -hmm. Buchanist. Um, could you repeat the word? Buchanist. Buchanist. B O U Q U I N I S T E. Buchanist. Good. Chiasmus. Chiasmus. A definition? <laughs> the inversion of the order of syntactical elements in the second of two juxtaposed and syntactically parallel phrases or clauses. Not a sentence. Chiasmus is frequent in Greek and Latin poetry. 
chiasmus. C H I A S M U S. Chiasmus. That's right. Tamarin. Tamarin. Could you repeat the word? Tamarin. Tamarin. T A M A R I N. Tamarin. That's right. Anacoluthan. Anacoluthan. Uh -huh. And the definition? Syntactical inconsistency or incoherence within a sentence. Anacoluthan. Uh -huh. A-N-A-C-O-L-U-T-H-O-N. Anacoluthan. Okay. Anastrophe. Anastrophe. A-N-A-S-T-R-O-P-A-G, an astrophe. You know. You know. Kind of definition? A two-toed sloth of Central and South America. You know. U-N-A-U, you know. Right. Thylacin. Thylacin. T-H-Y-L-A-C-I-N-E, thylacin. Radle. Radle. And the definition? Any of several powerful nocturnal carnivorous mammals resembling the badger and having the pelt ashy gray above and black beneath. Radle. R A T E L. Radle. That's right. Convertible. Convertible. C O N V E R T A B L E. Convertible. I'm sorry. Convertible? Convertible. C O N V E R T I B L E. That's right. Bribery. Bribery. And the definition? Mm -hmm. The act of influencing the action of another by a reward, gift, or favor bestowed or promised. Bribery. B R I B E R Y. Bribery. Congratulations. Josh, don't go away. Come over here. I know, Nevadita, congratulations. Amazing, amazing. What grade are you in? Seventh. And where do you go to school? Bowman Middle School. Where is that? Uh, it's in Plano. You have my permission to skip high school. You can go directly to college. You did a fantastic job. Nevadita, oh my goodness gracious. I want to congratulate all the kids that participated today. You guys all did a fabulous job. On behalf of the Dallas Morning News, we want to say thanks for being with us, and we'll see you next year. Take care. This has been the Dallas Morning News Regional Spelling Bee, brought to you live from WFAA-TV Channel 8. Our sincere thanks to all students, their parents, teachers, and school administrators in the Dallas region for making this program possible.